Hi, Brian Bush, field agronomist for Pioneer covering Southern Indiana. I want to talk specifically today to those non-GMO corn growers, the guys that don't have BT protection. Maybe that's non-GMO yellow, non-GMO white, waxy corn, even popcorn for that matter. I think we're about time to start managing that first generation of corn borer. So my goal is to try and kill the larvae before they can get into the midrib here. That begins about the third instar stage. So I'm not trying to kill the adults, those moths, I'm not trying to kill the eggs, um, but knowing we can get those larvae while they're out and available here before they burrow into that plant, I think we have a window here. Based off of trap counts we've got out, based off of GDU accumulation, I'm predicting that next week, from June 15th to June 22nd, is gonna be a great time to control the vast majority of those corn board larvae before they get into the plants. No matter how good a job we do, we're never gonna control 100% of the first generation corn borer. But this might be our best chance to help minimize the effect the first generation corn borer can have on our yields. Hope that helps. That concludes this Pioneer Agronomy video podcast. Visit our page on pioneer.com and follow us on Twitter and Facebook for more agronomy insights.